Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel Two Cents by Melody where I promote beauty both on the inside as well as on the outside. So today I'm not wearing any lipstick because I want to share with you four lipstick colors I think every girl should have in her collection. I'll be sharing four MAC lipsticks with you and I chose MAC because I feel like they have very good quality products. And all these four lipsticks I will be pairing with MAC Night Moth lip liner right here and let's get into the swatches. So the first lipstick I have here to show you is this nice pinky nude lip. I believe that every girl should have a nude lipstick in her collection. I would say this lipstick from MAC is plum full and it is a luster finish which means that this lipstick doesn't last that long on the lip. It does provide really nice hydration throughout the day though. So during these winter months when I want a nude lipstick I tend to wear plumful a lot and it lasts about three hours and then you have to reapply but i tend to just put it in my purse so let's get to the next lip so the next lipstick i would like to show you is called violetta um for me this is a nice pop of color however it's not too colorful i like this lipstick because um, it's an amplified finish number one so it does last longer. Um, I wear this when I want a pop of bright color and I like this lipstick. I want you guys to see the color. It's just a beautiful purple lip. I really enjoy it. It's becoming one of my favorite lipsticks really really fast. Um, so let's get into the next lipstick. Guys, look at this color. Look at how it has made my face pop. I think that every girl really needs to do herself a favor and find her a perfect red lipstick. I like this lipstick a little bit more than Max Ruby Woo because I think, um, first of all, I like that it's a satin finish so it doesn't dry you up too much but it is still very long lasting ruby wool has always chapped my lips i would say i recommend it it's exactly the same thing as ruby wool except that it has a satin finish and ruby wool has a very matte finish go try it out it is such a very good red lip for women of color especially so let me know what you guys think about this lipstick and let's get into the final lipstick that i think every girl should have in her collection So ladies, this is the final lipstick I have for you today. This is Max Rebel. I think that every girl should have a nice vampy or edgy lipstick. I would say edgy. Just in case you want to have that extra oomph on your face. This kind of lipstick is very good, especially in the fall time. Or if you have an event that you're going for where you just want to look extra serious or extra vampy or extra edgy i love this lipstick by mac mac rebel especially if you don't necessarily want to lose the color because there are so many dark lipstick that just look too dark on your lip if you're looking for a colorful like it does have a it does have that plumful feel it doesn't necessarily look too dark or too edgy it is it is just a really nice all year round lipstick for that edgy look that you're looking for. So I really do like Rebel. I wear this a lot to work when I have nothing to, like it's always in my purse. I wear it to work a lot of the times. Um, it's just an easy everyday like lipstick really for me. Okay everyone, I hope you enjoyed this video. If I was to recommend two lipsticks out of this for everyone to buy i think you need a red first you do need a red lip um and after that you could get a vampy color i i personally I mean, many people say nudes but i think i don't know i think like if you're wearing simple makeup like this every day i don't i want your lips to pop i want your lips to pop if you're wearing simple makeup because what's the point just have something popping on your face so i would say a red lip because it is very very classy looking and then this lipstick right here as your second bed like a nice vampy dark lip now say get your red get your vampy lip then get your nude 
then you can l think about what kind of color you like I tend to like purple so most of my pops of colors are purples alright guys I enjoyed filming this video I am feeling myself right now I feel so pretty oh man girls I feel pretty and you all have a wonderful day and I will see you in another video I hope soon but we would see my schedule has been so crazy I am in grad school and I work full-time so oh my world I love YouTube but my schedule is not allowing me to upload as I want as I was as I want to but we will see enough of my ranting I am glad I was able to film this video for you guys please subscribe to my channel let me know the favorite lipstick the color that you like best out of all my lips and um I'll see you soon bye guys